Winter is here. Let it snow, let it snow, let it... Wait, is that thunder? Seasonal science brings you thunder snow. If you happen to see the flash of lightning and hear the rumble of thunder during a snowstorm, consider yourself lucky. In the U.S., less than 10 storms per year produce what is known as thunder snow. But what causes this crazy winter phenomenon and why is it so rare? First, let's start with your average, everyday, not so special snowstorm. A typical winter snowstorm forms when warmer air is lifted over colder air. As the warm air rises, the moisture condenses and forms clouds and precipitation, and in this case, due to the cold surface temps, snow falls to the ground. But there's a major difference that separates your ordinary snowstorm from a thunder snowstorm, and that is the speed at which that warm air rises. In a thunder snowstorm, the upward moving air rises much faster. We're talking meters per second versus an ordinary snowstorm, centimeters per second. This rapid updraft causes precipitation and cloud particles to collide. The faster the updraft, the more collisions. And just like in a summer thunderstorm, these collisions cause different parts of the clouds to develop positive or negative charges. And once the difference in charges becomes large enough, lightning discharges to equalize everything. And what happens after lightning? Hello, thunder snow. Sounds simple enough, right? But thunder snow is rare, and it's rare because getting an updraft that fast during winter is difficult. Cold air in winter tends to make things stable, so it takes just the right set of circumstances to get air to rise quick enough. Thunder snowstorms form when either warm water heats the surface air, which rises, creating a fast updraft, or when strong weather systems cause air already aloft to rise faster than normal. But even when all the factors are in place, hearing the actual thunder is not a given. Because of all the snow created during one of these storms, and it tends to be a whole heaping lot, the rumble of thunder is muffled enough that it can only really be heard within a couple of miles of the lightning source. So if you do happen to witness this crazy weather phenomenon, go ahead and celebrate. Snow cones, anyone?